hello guys welcome back to my channel in today's video i'm doing a glitter cut crease makeup look if you want to see how cute this then definitely keep on watching so guys i already did my eyebrows off camera and for my eyes i'm going into my early girl concealer in the shade font to prime my eyes and i'm going to set that all with my setting powder from beauty by ed guys for my eyeshadow look i'm going into my yesi palette from j cosmetics and i'm taking on a big fluffy blending brush that bonds orange shade to apply all over my transition area back into the palette and I'm taking that muddy brown shade on a flat blending brush and I'm applying this color all over my crease blending it also into my transition area to make sure there are no harsh lines I'm also applying that same shade on the outer V of my eyes To cut my crease, I'm going to use my Ellie Girl Concealer in the shade Fun, and I'm using a flat brush to do this. I'm picking up that shade on the flat shader brush to apply all over my eyelid in all the places where I applied my concealer. Going back into that mother brown shade I applied on the outer view of my eyes and I'm blending it into my eyelid shade to make sure there are no harsh lines. Now I'm using my glitter liner that I got from AliExpress to line the edges of my cut crease. I'm creating a wing liner and I'm using my quick kill black liner for this. I'm going into my Zaran Lentling Mascara to prep my eyelashes for my falses. I'll be applying. I got this from AliExpress and I'm using my tweezer to apply this. For now, I'm done with my eyes and I'm moving on to my face. For my primer, I'm using my Santi Face Primer. And I'm just going to massage this in with my hands. Picking up my Colourpop No Filter Concealer in the shade Dark 48. I'm going to use this to conceal all my acne scars. And I'm picking up a flat blending brush to blend out the concealer. I'm going to use a liquid illuminator to highlight the high points of my cheekbone. For my foundation, 
foundation i'm taking two different foundations one from nyx from their can't stop one stop range and the milani conceal and perfect foundation in my nyx i'm using the shade cappuccino and for milani i'm using the shade amber milani is a bit light for me and the nyx is also too dark for me so once i mix it together i get my perfect shade i'm picking up my dose of glam beauty blender to blend out the foundation I'm going into my Colourpop No Filter Concealer in shade Medium Dark 38 and Dark 42. Dark 42 I used to conceal and 38 I used to highlight. I mixed the Colourpop No Filter Concealer in the shade Dark 48 and my LA Girl Expresso Concealer. So I'm using a flat blending brush from Zoeva. This is a Zoeva dupe actually because I got this brush from AliExpress. So I'm using that to blend out the contour. into the same damn beauty blender to blend out my concealer. with that same flat blending brush to blend everything out making sure that there are no hash lines between the contour and the highlight for my concealer i'm using my beauty by ed setting powder in the shade amber and i'm setting all places where i applied my concealer I'm making sure I press this powder into my skin to set all the places where I apply concealer. With this powder, I really don't like to bake underneath, underneath my eyes especially. I just like to set those areas.
Contour Pro palette and I'm taking the darker shade in the palette called Hollow. Picking up that same shade from the NYX Highlight and Contour Pro palette on a flat angled brush to contour my nose. back into my eyes and I'm picking up those same shades I use in my transition area and my crease area. I'm taking those shades on the pencil brush to apply all over the underneath of my eyes. Powdery, I'm going to set my face using my NYX Matte Finish Setting Spray. Tightening my waterline, I'm using my Maybelline Colossal Catch Out Black Eyeliner. Highlight and Contour Pro Palette and I'm taking that champagne shade to highlight the rest of my face picking up the highlighter with my finger for my cupid's bow and the bridge of my nose picking up that same shade on a flat blending brush to apply on my brow bone and the inner corners of my eye I'm using my early girl lip liner in the shade cafe. Lipstick, I'm using my Colourpop X makeup shade at in common sis. I'm using my Zaron XOXO lip gloss in the shade Coco. This is the complete makeup look, guys. Thank you all so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit the notification bell so that you get notified whenever I upload new videos. Also, don't forget to check the description box for the list of all the products I use down below. Thank you all so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And I'll see you all in my next video. Bye guys.